Are you seeing the error, threat service has stopped, restarted now on your Windows Defender virus and threat protection screen? Don't worry, in this video we'll walk you through the steps to fix this issue and get everything back to normal. The first step is to check for conflicts with third-party antivirus software. If you have a third-party antivirus installed, it might be interfering with Windows Defender. Open your system settings, go to the Apps section, and look for any installed antivirus software. Click the three-dot menu next to it and select Uninstalled. Follow the prompts to remove the software completely. Once uninstalled, restart your PC and check if the error is resolved. Signature. If it persists, let's move on to other solutions. Sometimes creating a new user account can solve the problem. Open Settings, go to Accounts, and scroll down to Other Users. Click Add Account and follow the instructions to create either an online or offline account. If creating a local account, enter a username, password, and security questions. Once the account is ready, log out of your current account and sign in with the new one. Check if the error persists on this new account. Next solution is to check if specific services are running properly. First, right-click on the Start button and select Run. In the Run window, type Services MSC and press Enter. Look for Windows Defender Advanced Threat Protection in the list. If you see that it's stopped, click on it and then select Start. Make sure its startup type is set to Manual, Sometimes, this service might stop automatically after you start it, but that's okay. Windows may not need it to run in the background all the time. Just ensure that the startup type is set correctly and it's not disabled. Next, find the Windows Defender Firewall service. This one should have a running status and its startup type should be set to automatic. If it's not running, start it and adjust the startup type accordingly. Another service to check is Windows Security Service. Ensure this service is running and its startup type should also be manual. If it's disabled or stopped, start it and set the proper startup type. Running the SFC and DISM commands can also be effective. Open the command prompt as an administrator by typing BND into the start menu, right-clicking it and selecting run as administrator. In the command prompt, type SFC slash scan out and press enter. Allow the scan to complete, then restart your PC. If the problem persists, open command prompt again and type dism slash online slash cleanup image slash restore health, then press enter. Once this scan finishes, restart your system and see if the issue is resolved. As a last resort, you can repair your Windows installation. Visit Microsoft's official Windows 11 download page and download the installation media. Run the media creation tool, accept the terms and choose upgrade this PC now. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the upgrade process. This will repair your windows without affecting your personal files and apps. Once done, the error should be resolved. That's it for this guide. If you have any questions or other methods that worked for you, share them in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell icon to get notified about more helpful Windows tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.